Do you have thousands of photos stuck on your computer and have no way of finding them? Let's make these photos searchable. In this video, I'm going to show you four options on how to make your photos searchable. Hi, I'm Amanda Littlecott, the photo organizer, and I'm all about helping you preserve and share your precious photo and video memories without getting overwhelmed. If you're looking to rediscover life's special moments and protect them for future generations, then be sure to subscribe and click the bell to be notified every time I release a new video. Having a ton of photos with random names and no way of searching them is about as useful as a chocolate teapot. But there are some simple and more complicated ways to make your photos searchable on both PC and Mac. For all those Apple Photo users out there, check out my sneaky tip on how to use Photos facial recognition tools to quickly tag people in your photos and be able to use it outside of Apple Photos. It's total genius. Option one, rename your photos. The most simple way to make your photo searchable is to put it in the file name because that is entirely searchable in File Explorer and Mac Finder. The most simple and basic option is to put the date in. The best way is to do year, month, day because then it also beautifully sorts itself when viewed by file name. Then you could put the event or location in to make it even more searchable, such as December 2015, New York. To find your photos, all you need to do is to search on those words and it will pop up. It can take a little bit of time to change all the names. However, check out my video about the photo sorting apps that you need to know about. And I talk about some crazy, amazing apps that you can use to quickly rename all of your photos. Option two, manual tagging. What do I mean by tagging? All of your photos and files have data that is sat in the background saying all sorts of stuff about your photos. And you can add words or tags into that data that is then totally searchable. To tag in Windows Explorer, you have a couple of options. You can either right click on the photo, go to the details tab and simply add the words under the tag section. For a quicker option, you can use the details plane that you can switch on in the view menu then you can add tags to the section on the right hand side. In Mac Finder, it is super easy. All you need to do is right click or double tap and go to get info. And then in the section that pops up, add your tags into the tag box at the top. There are also photo organizing programs out there that you can also use to add tags to your photos like Adobe Lightroom Classic but it's still a manual process and a decision for you as to whether you want to invest. When it comes to choosing what words to add, the best thing to do is to go from general to specific. So start with say the event or location and then get more detailed into the specifics like beach or house. Maybe there is a repeatable activity that you do every year, like having a picture taken around the Christmas tree, that would be a great thing to tag so you can easily find. When it comes to people's names, the choice is yours. But I usually go for first name and last name. But what you do about married names, you decide. My top tip is to keep a list of words that you've used to keep it consistent. Option three, keywording programs. Now, this one needs a little bit of investment, but there are some programs out there that you can buy that will search through your photos without putting them online or in a cloud storage and they will come up with suggestions for options of keywords based on what it can see in the images, such as car or beach. They are a great, quick, simple way of adding all those searchable tags to your photos. My current favorite is a nifty program called Xire Photo. Check it out in the links below. The keyword searching tools won't work for people, but there are still some options for you. Adobe Lightroom Classic has a decent, if not time-consuming, facial recognition tool. And if you're on a PC, tag that photo is a great option for finding and tagging people and loading those tags back into the photos. Unlike the people tagging options on say Apple or Google, you have to say yes or no to the recommended person in each photo. Okay, so you can do it in batches, but it's still a little bit time consuming. Option four, online cloud tools. 
If you are okay with loading your photos onto a cloud service, you can use one of the photo apps out there to tag your photos, but with a major warning. Most of the work will stay stuck in the app, so on your own head be it. However, super tip of the day, if you are an Apple Photo user, there is a sneaky way to get Apple Photos to do some of the work for you and then download all of that work. Head on over to Apple Photos, go to the people section and tell it who the people are. Select all the photos for one person and go to the information button at the top. Add a keyword of the person's name to all of the photos and then if you export the photos out of Apple Photos, the keywords go with it. Instant tagging! So there you have it, how to make your photos searchable. What other tips and tricks do you have to make your photos searchable? Leave them in the comments below. Are you struggling to actually start organizing your photos and videos? Don't know where to start? I have put together a simple, straightforward, quick start guide to organizing your photos that is linked in the description below. So click through and I will see you there. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead with a like and a share. Have fun rediscovering your memories. I'll see you in my next video.